Hi guys, my name is Alex. I'm the incorporation specialist at Bridges. I've helped more than 500 clients to set up their business in Hong Kong offshore. Today, I'm very glad to share some of the FAQ that I've encountered the most and some insider advice to my startup clients. Let's get started. Typically, we just need to provide with all the directors and shareholders valid passport, as well as with the address proof. It could be overseas utility bills or bank statements, as long as it's within the latest three months. However, if the director or shareholder will be a corporation, they will need to provide the CI, BR, AA, and a COI, or the register of directors and members. It would depend on what you opt to go for. Like ready-made company, as known as the shelf company, there will be least that you can choose and it will take around 2 working days. For all new company, it will take around 10 working days and everything will be start from scratch and submit all documentations to the company registry for authorizations. And more importantly, we also provide you with express service for all new company and it will only take around 2 working days. And it is very useful if you are in a rush to accomplish the setup. Absolutely yes, if the director or shareholder are not the Hong Kong residents, they can still apply the Hong Kong corporate bank account. Recently, we have a German client that is currently living in Thailand, has been successfully opened a corporate account by doing the trading business. And obviously, you can come to us that we can discuss further and review your case. The time spent for the bank assessment is completely different from every single bank. Like HSBC, it will normally take around 2-3 to three weeks after submitting all the required documentations and meeting them in person. Obviously, we have heard there are some cases from outside that has been taking for a couple of months. It's because of the sloppy follow-up or unfamiliarity banking compliance. And that is exactly why you need to get some valuable advice before submitting any applications to the bank. We have been working with some leading banks like HSBC, Hang Seng, DBS, OCBC, China City. Etc. Etc. We have been maintaining a good working relationship with them for the last couple of years, plus some new emerging banking solutions like need or currencies. We have another video that will be showing the highly interested bank topic, and feel free to click with the video link at our description below. You must be physically present in Hong Kong if you need to open a corporate bank account. While the company setup can be done remotely if you're located overseas. We would suggest normally to set up the company first before flying to Hong Kong. Once the company is set up, along with the bank appointment is fixed, then you can fly to Hong Kong to meet the banker and collect the company kit at our center. Pretty much the above is what my client usually asks during the initial startup stage. A client will also share his recent incorporation experience in order for you to know a little bit more in the video. After watching this video, I hope I can solve some of your puzzles. In my next video, I'm going to dig a little bit deeper in a bank account opening part, which is a hot topic among the startups. See you next time and bye for now. So we're a US asset manager based here in Hong Kong since 2007. And we've actually been partnering with Bridges since day one in the same office in the same location since that day. And the reason for that is really that Bridges is a one-stop solution for everything that our company requires and needs. So on the company side, everything from corporate filings to onboarding new hires, uh, as well as visa applications can all be done through Bridges. Uh, and then on a personal level as well, they've been very helpful with different tax return filings uh, and just general advice with some of Hong Kong's regulatory procedures. I'd say one of the best things about Bridges is how friendly and accommodative everybody is, uh, particularly the reception desk. Uh, and it's been a great pleasure to be partnered with Bridges for so long.